Hi, fourth graders. Thank you so much for joining K-Kids. K-Kids is a fantastic organization sponsored through our local Qantas group. And basically, K-Kids do things for others. Um, it's a service group where we help, we volunteer, we do things to make the world a better place. Now you um, should have, if you haven't, pick it up, a packet. And the packet looks something like this. Um, they're here at Star for you. You come in the front doors of Star and there's a basket sitting right there. Let's take a look at this packet. Now when we come back for in-person learning, we'll do more activities. Um, hopefully like our canned food drive in the winter, um, other things, Valentine's Post Office. But for now, these are things that you can do at home while we are apart. Let's take a look quickly at the packet. Um, there are four projects. And I'm going to have y'all finish it by a certain date and then submit those packets, those things back to me, and I will distribute them. I'll pass them out for us. The first project is decorating lunch bags. And these are bags that are in your um, kind of kit. Mobile Meals delivers meals to people who are shut-ins, who are unable to leave their home. Sometimes they're elderly folks. Sometimes they're people with disabilities. For whatever reason, these people are housebound. So their lives can be um, pretty lonely sometimes, sometimes sad. So the purpose of this project is to send, spend or send a little love and kindness their way. I made some example lunch bags um, quickly just for some ideas. Like this one says shine bright. And notice when they open the bag, this is how the bag will sit. So when you're drawing your bag or designing it, remember, this is how the bag will be delivered. So um, shine bright, have a sunny day. Um, I have be happy, be bright, be you. This is, um, and these are a couple of kids made last year. Um, stay awesome and kind. And this one was just sweet. Have a good meal. So you can decorate those bags. The second project is Kindness Project 2, designing tear-off posters. And I included two in your bag. If you would like more, just let me know. Um, one says, never underestimate the power of a random compliment. And the other one is basically take and spread kindness, the kindness campaign. And I left these up to you to be as creative as possible. Just writing little notes, quotes, um, kind words, and then you cut along the dotted lines up. And people can then rip off um, the comment or kindness um, quote that meets their need, that makes them feel good. So these are two. You can either return them to me, or if you and your family have some ideas like, hmm, I'd like to place one at Kroger, at my church. At wherever it is, just make sure you have permission from whoever owns the board or whatever. Make sure that it's okay with them that you post it. Project number three is writing a letter to someone in the military. Um, I believe this is a very powerful thing for a lot of people. The organization that um, we are going to be sending our letters to is Operation Gratitude. So boys and girls, just give me your letters and I will put them all together in a package. This is information. It tells you um, how to address your letter, what to include, and what um, not to include. So there are some specifics here. So your parent may need to help your family member, grandma, whoever is with you. I included some examples, some things that you can use. Just fill them out, color them. But if you want to create your own, feel free. You are as creative. They take everything. They take um, construction paper things. They take things that are painted. Whatever you want to um, send. And again, you'd return those to me. And the fourth project is, I've got a mess going on here. Believe it or not, Mrs. Taylor gets messy, is help celebrate World Smile Day. This was created by the person, um, Harvey Ball is the person who originally, originally designed that smiley face, the yellow um, smiley face symbol that we all know and love. And his dream was to have um, one day a year that we spread an act of kindness or do something to make someone else smile. 
The day this year is Friday, October 2nd. So that is the day that I'm hoping you go out and spread kindness in honor of World Smile Day. There are a couple things. This is you can do as little or as much as you want to. Um, take it away. And boys and girls, if you do do something, I would love for you to send me a picture of you, where you are, what you're doing, the thing you made. Um, share it with me. And then I'd like to make a collage of all the things our K Kids members have done for this quarter. Because um, I want to show us off. Because you chose to do this. You're not getting paid. You're not getting bonus points. You're not getting a pizza party. You are getting to feel good about you and making a difference and making people's lives better. So if you, whatever you do, send me a picture, send me your stuff and I'll make something fantastic to celebrate us. So just some things. Um, I included this fun little guy. Take your picture. You can put it like on a popsicle stick. Smile with people like a photo. Um, what do you call those props? Those photo props? I'm not thinking of the word right now. Example of a smile. Decorate them, design and post them somewhere. Write someone a note. I gave you some bigger paper. And I gave you some smaller paper. I kind of thought this one would be neat if you wanted to like make a neighbor cookies or make a postcard, um, a postcard, a bookmark, um, make something for someone. And you could just like stick this on it and say, you know, thinking of you, happy world smile day, you know, so-and-so, um, K kids member. I even included, I think I included these. I'm pretty sure I did. And I thought that might be a little sticker to attach your note onto. Again, the, all these are optional, but of course, the more you do, the more goodness we put out into the world. If you have any questions for me at any time, please let me know. As you get your packet done, um, we will aim for the end of the quarter. I believe that's October 16th. Um, I'll contact you with more information, but the things you have saved, you can put it back in your bag and I will um, collect those and then I will pass them out um, to those who would appreciate them. Thank you so much. Um, thank you again for your commitment to this wonderful, wonderful service um, organization.